Today we start our second uh, round of IVF and I have a little bit of a stomach ache. I don't have any pants on. I was gonna ask if it was like, uncomfortable. Don't, don't <laughs> speak. <laughs> So what are we here for today? Uh, our baseline sonogram to start our frozen embryo transfer cycle. So this is the step one. Dumb it down, step one of our second IVF journey. And because we already have embryos, we don't have to do all of the um, other like shots in the belly and retrieving the eggs. We already have our little frozen in babies. So this one's easier and cheaper. <laughs> yes, definitely <laughs> cheaper. Thank goodness. Still expensive. Still expensive. But not as expensive. Yeah. Sarah has very healthy ovaries. A good house, as the doctor said. We hope for a good tenant. I have still have 20 eggs. A ton of eggs. Didn't he, think I would. He dropped a subtle hint that Sarah would be a good donor. So, who knows? Maybe years down the road, that'll be another video series. <laughs> Why are you kids? <laughs> We're in for our second appointment. This is the trial transfer, and the transfer is when they actually put the embryo in Sarah. So this is the trial transfer. They just want to make sure they can get in there without any kind of blockage or issues. We did this before. It's not super comfortable for Sarah, but um, it's also not as bad as like retrieval or something like that. So <clears throat> appointment number two. It is March 8th. 2019 we just finished up at the IVF clinic and we have transfers scheduled for next Friday the 13th uh, I don't know so what is next Friday 8 plus 7 15 15 <laughs> uh, we will be transferring one embryo We'll find out on March 25th if we are pregnant. And the drugs are here. And they're not the fun kind of drugs. So we probably got really hyped up about doing the first shot, the first progesterone shot, and totally forgot to film anything for our little remember this video but we did the first shot it's done really was not bad when jacob first put the needle in it did start i could tell when he was pushing the medicine in because i could feel that burning which i heard that it would but the the insertion of the needle was not bad very i'm a pro very good work i'm a pro this being the second shot that i've given in my entire life <laughs> First was the trigger shot from the from Gabriel, and then this one. This is to be the first of many mm -hmm. in this cycle. So, all right, I didn't pass out. We're off on a on a good foot here. I'm glad you survived that. <laughs> Where are we headed? We're on our way to transfer. Today's the day. I'm gonna go watch Sarah get pregnant. <laughs> gonna videotape it. <laughs> Are you ready? Are you ready for this? Can you not blind me? Show us. We're gonna put this one in. It's already starting to hatch. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Amazing. I like that. Okay, now with the 
cap. Yeah, you are. Okay, I think I'm fine. We're going to check the catheter to make sure the ember is in. Okay. What that's you see is a white reflection. That's the bubble. That's the air bubble. That's it's a very close to the ember. You can't see the ember because it's microscopic. Uh, that's pretty good. That's a good place for it to be. Good. We are now at the stage where we are pregnant until proven otherwise. Do you feel pregnant? Yeah, I do feel pregnant. Ask, then touch. <laughs> so it is March 28th, two o'clock in the afternoon. Sarah went in and got her blood work this morning. One more shot. This one I didn't have to do. How am I doing on the shots, by the way? Doing pretty good. Hadn't passed out yet. Anyway, Sarah gave, gave blood. She had her blood work done this morning and we are patiently waiting for the phone call from the IVF clinic to find out if we are in fact with child. Come on, Sarah, how are you? I'm good, how are you? I'm doing well. Hey, you got your lab done today, didn't you? I did. I have the results for you. Are you sitting down? I am. <laughs> you are pregnant. Woo! Yay! Yeah. They told me you took an at-home test. I know you're like completely shocked. But I am officially official. Yay. What were my um, HCG levels? It was 118. Perfect. So anything technically over like five, we consider pregnant. So awesome. you're 118. <laughs> you're definitely pregnant. Awesome. Good news. What are we doing here? We're gonna have an early OB ultrasound. Early OB ultrasound, and what are we looking for? Gestational sac. Gestational sac. You gonna repeat everything I say? Everything you say. <laughs> so how did that go? It went very well. Tell her what she said. She said a lot of things, but... <laughs> <laughs> That's why I asked you to do it, because I don't remember. <laughs> My uh, uterine lining was perfect. The little yolk sac was a perfect little ring. Everything was measuring as it should. I'm five weeks, five days. And our estimated due date is December 6th. Everything was perfect. <laughs> she said my ovaries looked good. All my insides looked good. Birth canal is nice and closed. As it should be. <laughs> yeah, we're not ready for him to come out yet. Him, her, whoever, it. So, good reports. Yay! We're at the OB for the first time. We're going to see the new baby. And everybody's kind of sick from some kind of stomach bug. <laughs> so we're all smiling, but we all kind of feel, oh. We're gonna see the new baby today. So is that the head on the left? So, it's time for the final shot. How many of these have we done? Was 12 times I can, 7. I can't do math. 66 plus... A lot. 72. Was it 72? 71. I think we figured out it was 71 72. or 72. 72 <laughs> shots in Sarah, poor Sarah's butt. <laughs> this is the last one. As of today, we are successfully pregnant hey. and tired. <laughs> so tired. Successfully pregnant with baby number two through our IVF efforts. We'll keep first trimester. Yeah. In today. So we wake up tomorrow. We'll be in the second trimester. I wake up tomorrow and I'm gonna feel amazing, right? <laughs> Please. <laughs> That's what I think. 
Hey, and real quick, tell them all how I've done with the shots. He's done very, very well. He's <laughs> a very good shot giver. So if you need a shot, come to my house, I'll stick it in there. <laughs> We've got plenty of needles. <laughs> and after about number 72, I'm not even gonna really think about it anymore. I'm just gonna <laughs> stick it in there and get it over with. Good morning, everybody. It's uh, 7.20 on July 11th. I didn't sleep very well last night because uh, a lot of anticipation, excitement about today. Today's the day we find out the gender of the baby. So uh, Sarah's getting ready, or uh, just got up, I think. I'm about to have some coffee. And we're gonna get Gabriel ready. We're gonna take him to the doctor with us. And we're all gonna find out whether he's having a little brother or a little sister. What are we doing here today? Good night. Oh, good night. He pressed the button. <laughs> We're gonna find out what the baby is. Gabriel, are you excited? Yes, I am. Yes, you are? <laughs> Me, I <won't>. am. <laughs> <laughs> Having a girl. Gabriel, you excited about that? Gabriel, you gonna be a big brother? No. You want a little sister? No. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> <laughs> He's more occupied with the magna doodle. Oh, that one does colors. Oh, that's neat. I digress. <laughs> so we're having a girl. So exciting. I think we had a suspicion. Oh, I knew. Well, is it? It's kind of holding out hope for a boy, but I'm happy that it's a girl. I'm happy. I really am, like, for real. Mmm. You have to buy all new things. Lord help us. <laughs> Here we go. So thank you for following along on our IVF journey this go-round. The vlog 20 weeks in the making. It's been 20 weeks. 19. 19? 19 weeks? Well, 19 yeah. weeks of pregnancy, but all the lead up to it. All the lead up to it. I don't know. Been a long one. <laughs> Gabriel's putting his input in from the back. So we're very excited. I don't know if you've seen, um, you know, the the Sharps container in the background of our videos and wondered How what I'm that was about. How I'm always shot from here above. Yeah. Or you haven't seen me very much or any of us very often because it's been... Our, our vlogs have been a bit irregular lately <laughs> because there have just been some days when it's we just much. can't have not been able to crank one out. So, but I'm glad that we were able to record this, and so we have it, you know, for posterity. This whole process and all things like that. They did tell me today that you're not allowed to film in the ultrasound room anymore, but I did anyway. Of course. <laughs> but that was a new thing, so. I'm glad we got to film everything we did before they told me on the last day that you you can't film in here. She was very nice about it. <laughs> well, so I filmed anyway. But thank you all for watching this journey and everything. And now you get to, now we can openly talk about Sarah being pregnant in future vlogs. Ooh. <laughs> I know, exciting. Thank you all for watching. Gabriel. Can you say thanks for watching? No. He's over it. <laughs> <laughs> well, all right. We'll see y'all next time. Bye-bye. Nothing. Bye-bye. <laughs>